Hey everyone, Sean here with photodeox.com and happy Halloween. So we're gonna do something a little different uh, than we normally do on this channel. And we are going to review a film camera. This is the Jolly Look Instax mini camera. Uh, this was kickstarted a while back and we decided it would be fun to try it out. But you push this button here, you pop open, and there we go, here's the lens board. And this camera has a zone focusing board. So we've got infinity, and then we've got 2.5 meters, which is eight feet. And we can also go to one meter, which is three feet. And then we can go to 0.65 meters, which is two feet. The way the shutter works is really interesting. You actually pull this up and then you push this button to drop the shutter down. To control the aperture, you turn this little wheel on the side. This camera has aperture settings from F8 to F64 and a pinhole. And the way you shoot the pinhole is you're actually going to use this little lever down here, which will go from normal shutter to bulb shutter. And I will point out something that you probably have noticed. The, <laughs> the lens is not straight. You pull it out like this and it just folds back in. I actually saw some people online were recommending uh, cutting straws. So I took some coffee straws. So cutting straws for the different lengths. So for my infinity focus, I have this straw which you know makes it about level. So then I can just focus on taking the shot and I don't have to worry about using another hand to kind of hold the lens uh, steady. And that's another issue I've run in with this camera. Even when I'm trying to hold the lens parallel to the film plane, it generally is a little off. So you know half of my photo will be in focus and the other half won't. Or the whole thing will be out of focus even when I have it set to infinity. You can capture some really interesting lo-fi instant film shots. They're just not always going to be in focus or you know very sharp. Installing film in the camera is super easy. We're gonna use some color Instax film with a black border. Then you're gonna wanna make sure that your yellow dot is lined up with the top of the camera right here because that's where the film comes out. Push it into place. And then these two foam pieces are gonna push the film down so you can keep advancing the film. Just close it up. <laughs> because this is a cardboard camera, pieces are going to maybe stop working quicker than you want them to. I mean, I've only had this camera for a couple days and already I'm having to tape it. But hey, you've got tape, you might as well use it. <laughs> so first we gotta get out the dark slide because Instax film has a dark slide to protect it from light. And we're just going to crank it out like this, turning it clockwise. Here we go. And they tell you to crank till it's almost out. There we go. Okay, we have the Instax film loaded into the Jolly Look camera. Let's go shoot some portraits with this amazing little cardboard camera and photo deox lights. So we've got 10 shots in this roll of film and we're gonna shoot a couple outside. Here are a couple photos we captured. And like I said before, it is really hard to focus this camera. Okay, next we went into our studio and we set up a little three light setup with our new Skyfiller LED constant source lights. These are wonderful lights for video and photography. They're beautifully diffused, they're powerful, and using constant source LED lights like our Skyfiller 3 light kit is essential when you're shooting with a camera like this, a cardboard camera. It has no sync, so there's no way to sync it with flashes. So when we shot our portrait, all we had to do was set up the lighting, meter it with a light meter app, and then we were ready to shoot and we knew that we'd get exactly what we saw in front of us. So constant source lights are really essential when you're shooting this kind of experimental instant film photography. Okay, that was a quick look at the Jolly Look Cardboard Instax camera. In my next video, I'm actually going to dismantle this camera and turn it into an ultra wide angle Instax mini camera. So stay tuned for that. Click the links in the description below if you'd like to learn more about the Skyfiller LED lights featured in today's video or learn more about the Jolly Look. Click here to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this one and click here to see the video where I destroy this little guy and turn him into a Frankenstein monster pinhole camera. I'm Sean with photodeox.com and happy Halloween.